is going on my YouTube people? It is Gavin Acidy here again with you for another video. And in this video, I wanted to kind of talk to you guys and discuss my opinion and kind of review of sniping in Black Ops 3 because it is a bit different than some of the ordinary CODs. So for the most part, I only use the Locust sniper rifle, which is a bolt action sniper rifle. It's the first one that you get that is already unlocked. And then there's a semi-auto sniper called the Draken or Draken, however you want to call it. And it's a, a semi-auto one that shoots a bit faster. It kind of reminds me of a DMR, mostly one hit kill, but not quite as powerful as the Barrett. But for the most part, we will be talking about the Locust. First off, right off the bat, which is something that I noticed, which I think is kind of cool, is the Locust seems to remind me of the ballista like a futuristic ballista I know in black ops 2 uh, the ballista was supposed to be like the futuristic sniper rifle looked all high-tech and stuff and that's kind of what this gun and looks and feels similar to the ballista especially when you're switching weapons how you pull it over your shoulder just feels a lot like the ballista which is good because it's nice to see something familiar in this game since it's pretty high-tech so with the locust the bolt action is kind of slow the fire rate is really slow on this weapon it seems to be slower than uh, the ballista more similar to like the DMR in Black Ops 2, but just overall pretty slow. I felt it somewhat difficult to get uh, rapid kills or two guys in a row, but you can put on a rapid fire attachment, which makes it significantly better and easier to shoot with and gives you a better chance to take out multiple enemies at once. And the other really cool thing, I don't know if it's just me or this game or what, but it seems to me like you can hit a lot more collaterals in this game. I within a span of like two hours I hit three collaterals and I'm used to like never hitting any or hardly hitting any so I was pretty surprised on how many collaterals I hit and one of my buddies he kind of mentioned to me which I felt a similar issue with this game I don't know if it's the lag compensation or something like that but it seems like when you shot somebody like really close to them but you really shouldn't have hit them you end up with a kill which I mean hey I can't complain because it is a kill but at the same time, I don't like that in the game just because you want to make sure everything is perfect and accurate. But like I said, it just seems a little bit off. So if you were really close to any, but, but kind of felt like you should have missed, sometimes you would end up getting the shot. This could have been some sort of issue with the beta. I know um, towards when the actual release came out, the servers had problems and they were crashing a lot. But that, like I said, it could be something with the beta, but that was just one of the little things that I was noticing while sniping. Next topic that I want to talk to you guys about, and it's probably my main concern in Black Ops 3 with the sniping, is the aim down sight. Now the aim down sights mechanic is completely different from anything that we have seen in any other COD, and it's just kind of a little bit weird and difficult in a way. Like you can quick scope, it is something that is there, but it is a little bit on the harder side and it's something that you would have to get used to and take a while to get used to that. When I first used the snipers, I absolutely hated it. I felt like sniping sucked. You, I find it very difficult to kill anybody at close range and I just, I figured I wasn't gonna be sniping much after I uh, tried that out. But you know, I used it a little bit more and I didn't find it too bad after a while. It's just like I said, something you're gonna have to get used to. However, when you're already aimed down sight, it feels kind of overpowered. It is so easy while you move with your scope. It has to do with the way that they change the sensitivity while aim down sight. It just feels a lot smoother. I did find it kind of difficult also along with quick scoping because I'm on a higher sensitivity. I do play on insane. It is like very hard to control and I've heard people say even on 4 and very low sensitivities and sniping is hard to control and on 20 is just almost impossible when I was first trying it so that's kind of why I found it a little bit difficult but once you get used to it like I said it is very good aim down sight is very easy to use with the sniper rifle I found myself not holding my breath very much while sniping it was just easy to move from one target to the next and just kind of you know sit in scope and take people out Overall, the best way to kind of explain the aim down sight mechanic and how it feels is the zoom in feels very slow at first, but then just jerks really fast in. So it's kind of like hard to really explain for you guys to relate and know how what I'm talking about until you play it and kind of feel out the sniper rifles. You'll see a little bit what it looks like, but you don't really notice it as much until you start playing and using the sniper rifle. In terms of the sniper rifle damages, um, I feel like this game just in general has a lower time to kill but the, the snipers feel very very good I felt like I had very few hit markers the locust is very strong anything kind of waist high and even if you shoot them in the shoulder it's a one hit kill obviously if you shoot somebody in the foot you're not gonna get the, the one hit kill but very very strong and even the draken for what short little time I have used it if you shoot somebody in the chest it is a one hit 
hit kill, but again, doesn't feel quite as strong as like a Barret or something like that. But yeah, very good in terms of damage in this game, and I enjoyed that a lot about it. My overall verdict of sniping in Black Ops 3 is it is good. I like it a lot. It's very fun. I do find it difficult at times with the aim down sight mechanic, but it kind of evens out while your aim down sight is very easy to use. And just, I enjoy the damage, everything about the snipers are, are awesome, I think it's something that we'll have to get a little bit used to in terms of quick scoping. but you know, it's definitely there, and they might change this when the actual game comes out, so who knows. But yeah, like I said, overall, just awesome, but that's pretty much it for this video. If you did enjoy this video, please hit that like button, comment down below, maybe what is your favorite sniper of all CODs, like in any COD. If you could choose your favorite sniper rifle, leave that in the comment down below. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And as usual, you guys have a good one. Peace. Securing B.